one thing I think we can agree now that there is the clear possibility of copious errors in the Bible. Only, only this particular. Only this? Okay, yeah, as far you... as I know, okay, as far okay. as I know. I got you. Yeah, yeah. You see these stickies? Yeah. We got but that doesn't to go worry me. That doesn't it, worry me. It does me. worry me, and I'll explain why. If you can convince me, I'm open. Yeah, fantastic. But if I convince you, you're open. I'm to give some of the materials to the book as well. As it is spread out. You have a tent. Let me just ask you. Give it out to it. If you convince me, I'm open. Yeah. But you said you're closed minded. No, I'm not from my father. Even if I convince you, if I show you clear proof. No, it's no clear proof in you because I've got the book. Don't you think that's closed minded? No, no. You don't think it's closed minded. So if I tell you, if I tell you this is brown and you say no, it's red, and I tell I can prove oh, no, that it's brown. It's brown. No, Excellent. It's brown. So yeah. if you thought it was red and I show you it's brown, would you change your mind? If you show me it's red. If I show you it's brown, if you yeah. thought it was red, that brown feeling, yeah. and I showed you it's brown, yeah. would you change your mind? No, I can see it as brown. Yeah. Excellent. So when you can see it, you would believe it. Yeah, not to your but, faith, because my faith is so strong. <laughs> but, but, but do you my see, do you see the hypocrisy so there? Strong. I know, but, but hold on, hold on, hold on. Yeah. We're going to have a conversation, relax, <laughs> take a breath. Yeah. But we want to be productive. Yeah. If yeah. you are going to come and say that even if you can prove to me I'm not going to leave my faith, yeah. this is not a productive conversation, is it? I will use, I'll tell you why, uh -huh. and I've talked to some of these people here as well. When I gave my life to Christ, because I've been taught as a Christian, but I wasn't a true Christian until I gave my life to Christ when I was 31. And um, it was on my toes all the way through my body, it was way back the way from my feet. It was wonderful. And I was on cloud nine, uh, hang on a minute, I was on cloud nine uh, for about three or four weeks. And they got the sun over me from the top. And then I waited because I didn't want to get fully immersed in the water until the Holy Spirit was waiting. I didn't want to listen to anybody else. So it was 10 years, around 10, well, just before 10 years, when I, when I was sat there watching somebody being, being, um, being um, baptized. And then I felt a nudge forward in my back, gentle. And I thought, oh, that's Holy Spirit. That night I went to bed. And when I was praying, in the middle of a prayer, I paused and came the words as clear as anything, get baptised. And then um, I had to wait, which made it 10 years when I got fully immersed in water. Now before then, I wasn't um, interested in politics or anything like that, you know, to do with that. Except I did used to vote now and again, but nothing, I was not in, in any allegiance with anybody. And I just used to vote what I wanted at the time. And not every time either. And then, um, after I was fully immersed in water, it changed. And I, uh, I'm, I'm cutting a long story short. Um, I think that was long story long. Yeah, sorry, <laughs> this part is short. Okay, gotcha. And um, I became a local councillor okay. for Melton Road in the Black. And, um, and then I did four years on that, and then I did another four years later on, and I became mayor of, um, of the Melton Road and um, yeah, and, and it was only through God. I couldn't have done that on my own, it was through God because He gave me words to speak. What's your name? Marilyn. So, Marilyn, are you done? Because I want to listen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come to me. So, the experience that you felt, I don't deny. I have met Hindus that have had amazing experience. I have met Satanists who felt that they had amazing, miraculous experiences. I have met Muslims that have had amazing experiences. I have met Jews that have had amazing experiences. None of that is a criterion for true and wrong. We know that some people, they do drugs and they feel they're on cloud nine. Some people, they get affected by jinn, they feel that they're on cloud nine. That's not an evidence. But my question to you is, here you brought scripture to me, right? If I show scripture to you from your own scripture, and I can prove to you Jesus isn't God. Why would you not be open-minded enough? No, well, let me finish, if you don't mind. Right? Why would you not be open-minded enough to say, if you can prove to me the truth, I'd accept it, I as I was. I know the truth. But, but see, don't you see that's incredibly close-minded? Because no, you no, haven't no, even listened to I, me. Yeah, I'm let me. Let me just say one thing, if you don't mind. Yeah. Imagine I try one flavor of ice cream. Mm -hmm. I try vanilla. 
and I tell you it's the best flavor in the world. Yeah. And you tell me, hey, I have strawberry, mm -hmm. chocolate chip, mint and chip. Let me just show them to you. And I say, no, <laughs> this is the best in the world already. No. You it's in the UK. You got all kinds of halal food, right? And I would tell you, no, this is so much better already. You would tell me this guy's close-minded. I came to you and I said, look, I'm open to listening and accepting the truth. But you came to me and you said, I'm not open. Even if you prove to me the truth, I'm not going to accept it. Just tell me honestly, Marilyn. I'm not, it's not a debate. Yeah. We're just having a conversation. Yeah. Honestly, don't you think it's a little close minded? Like, I'll tell you why. Now, when Adam, right, our first Adam, you know, when the first. More than uh, one Adam? Uh, the first Adam, yeah. Who's the second well, Adam? Well, no, I'll tell you in a minute. I'll tell you in a minute. But the first Adam, he brought that. Now, Jesus. He brought that? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. What do you mean? He, when he had the apple and that. Well, say I mean, apple God fruit, ordained fruit. that, not Adam. Yeah, yeah, that's what I mean. Uh, but because of what he did, the sin, he brought death. In that sense, in that sense, because of the sin. Because God says, if you take a picture, if you read this particular tree, I'll be saying, Real quick, so, so where did you get that belief from, the Bible? It's in you, yeah. It okay. should be in your Bible as well. Sure, sure, but let me just ask you. Yeah, this it because should also because you follow the first five books, don't you? Of, um, I follow the Quran. Yeah, which is the first five books. No, no that's not the Quran. The Quran is not. No, the I know first it's not, but yeah. no, but I mean, you follow the first five books in the Bible, though. I Moses, do not. Uh, I, I follow the Quran, which if you don't have one, I can give you one as I've a gift. Excellent. <laughs> so I believe in the Quran. Yeah. What I believe is there was a message revealed to the Prophet mm -hmm. Moses, right? Yeah. And there was a message revealed to the Prophet David. Yeah. And there was a message revealed to the Prophet Jesus. Yeah. Prophet David. He's called the Prophet in the Bible as well. So. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, so, yeah, yeah. so the Prophet David, the Prophet Jesus. Not the Prophet, prophet Jesus, he's not the same. Let me, let me finish what I'm saying. <laughs> okay. Now, those messages that were revealed, I believe. This which you have today is not those messages. And let me explain it. The earliest manuscripts that you have for the Old Testament are the Dead Sea Scrolls, correct? Mm -hmm. Yes, yeah, yeah. Not some of them. Not, you have to look it up. Some were the Dead Sea Scrolls and some was from obviously the Good, first. The earliest ones that you have yeah. are the Dead Sea Scrolls that you can manuscript. And those are around 200 BC. So obviously that's not anywhere close to the time of Moses. Right? I think on Moses wrote the first five books. I'm sorry? Moses wrote well, I, I wish you would leave that here. Do you have those writings from Moses? Yeah, it's there. It's in the Bible. Moses wrote these? Yeah, yeah. He wrote those. Yeah. Yeah. Is it manuscript? Yeah, it says in, in like my Roland, thing Roland that Moses English? wrote it. Well, no. Okay. So the earliest yeah. manuscripts that you, you became Muslim today. are from about 200 years before Jesus. This is amazing. So they are not anywhere close to the time of Moses. And the manuscripts... And the Dead Sea Scrolls, and what they did was uh, some of them was um, sort of uh, made it authentic, made it authentic, you know, that you can see that uh, what was written in the Bible. If, if the earliest scripture that you have is from 200 years, actual manuscript, before Jesus, peace and blessings be upon him, then obviously Moses' writings are not with you. Okay? After the fall of Babylon, after the displacement of the people of Israel, early scriptures are all gone. So what you have today, and even the Dead Sea Scrolls, let me, let me finish. Even the Dead Sea Scrolls have disagreements between scripture. Let me explain this to you. Second Samuel, chapter 24, verse 9. Then Job gave the son sum of the number of the people to the king. And there were in Israel 800,000 billion men. How many? Who drew sword. And then the men of Judah were 500,000. How many? So Israel was 800,000. Judah was? Uh, five yeah, five. No wonder you were a mayor, you're so yeah, intelligent. No, I, just, I, you the first I got you. Yeah, I got you. <laughs> first Chronicles 21, 5. Then yeah. Job gave the sum of the number of the people to David. Same Job, same yeah. King David. All Israel had was 1,100,000. Yeah, yeah. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I know where you're going, but relax. Let's just go through this, right? Who drew the sword. And Judah had 400,000, 470,000. So now, from 800,000, we went to 1,100,000. From 500,000, we went to 470,000. 
Which one did King David, King uh, or Moses write? Which one are we? Which one are we on now? First Chronicle, yeah. twenty-one. Don't forget five. the first five books. Okay. Moses. okay, so these are not from Moses. Yeah, no. So who wrote these? Uh, I, I, oh, it's got somewhere. Hang on, I'll have a look. Um, first of all, what did you say, Chronicles? First Chronicle. Yeah. First Chronicles, what was this? Chapter 21, yeah. verse 5. Verse 5. Would you like some water or anything? No, I'm okay at the moment. Thank you. No problem. Would you like a chair? Oh, no, it's okay. Perfect. Yeah. <laughs> okay. um, right. Um, so that was fine. Um, in all this time, we could have done a nice masala in Zahid al Mustaqni, man. Inshallah. <laughs> says here, two Samuel 24 We'll have time for Zahid and Bulu and have time for this. We have two Samuel 24 9. Is that the one you said before? Two Samuel? Uh, yes. Yeah. Two Samuel. It has 800,000 in Israel, yeah. 500,000, which could be a round number for 470,000 in Judah. The reason for the difference is unclear. Perhaps it is different. So the Bible has been clear. No, this bit is. Perhaps so, oh, okay, I, I just want to understand. I just understand. First thing you're saying is 800,000 mm -hmm. can be rounded to 1,100,000. Oh, no, it said 470. So what about the 800,000? Yeah, let's just have a read down to see if we can find it. Find the what? Right. Perhaps it is related to the unofficial and incomplete nature of the census. And that's got, I don't want to prove it. With the difference, with the difference, with the difference, with the difference, with the uh, let me finish. Some advice. So, yeah, yeah, let me finish. Sorry, let me <laughs> to say it. Uh, uh, the other guy right, the white guy. Get, get his number. Did you get his number? Yeah, don't let them go unless you get their number. Joab did not include Levi or Benjamin in the numbering because the king's command was repulsive to him. And this is going to be four? That's, um, that is um, six. Yeah. So now, the first thing is, when you talk about rounding, oh, hang on. it says here, or perhaps it's the mic on the ship for this. Oh, I'm sorry. And I, yeah, it does say that, or perhaps, yeah, or perhaps it is simply due to a copyist mistake. Which I, which I don't think. Okay, so you're saying there are copyist errors hmm? in the Bible. And this is from your I'll, commentary. Allah provides. No, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, no, no, no. But it could be. Can I see? Yeah, it? there you go. Let yeah. me just. Let me, this is yours, right? Yeah, yeah. I didn't bring this. Oh, no, no, that's mine. This no, this excellent, is mine. Excellent, yeah. excellent. Or perhaps it's simply due to a copyist mistake. Shakes too much. The NIV relieves the problem somewhat by translating the conjunction, changing the translation to including instead of an. Interesting. So now, your own Christian commentary yeah. is saying that there could be another discussion. And this is, this is Shahada, just now, we want to give some. MashaAllah, three! Allah Akbar! May Allah make you firm in the religion. I mean, yeah. yeah. one of the highest places, inshallah, for you. Yeah? Inshallah. Yo! Yeah, we're all family. Um, all all good things, we're all one family. Hussein! Yeah. Okay. So, one thing I think we can agree now that there is the clear possibility of copyist errors in the Bible. Only, only this particular Only this? Okay, yeah, as, far as, okay, as far as I know, as far as I know. I got you. Yeah, yeah. You see these stickies? Yeah, we got but that doesn't to go worry me. That doesn't it, worry it me. It does worry me, and I'll explain why. Yes. I got you. Alright, let's go to 2 Kings yeah. 24 8. I'm really glad you came. Yeah, I'm really glad I'm came. You're yeah. ready. You'll be happier. <laughs> no, no, no. This is a lot of honor. Keep holding your breath. That will be on 24. Second Kings, 24 8. Yeah, Jehoiachin was 18 years old. He reigned in Jerusalem. Tomorrow, I think he waits. How old was he? 18. Okay, can you open Second Chronicles? Nine thirty-six. Nine thirty-six. Nine thirty-six. Nine thirty-six. Should be Second Chronicles thirty-six. Oh, thirty-six. I'm sorry, thirty-six. Nine. Five. Thirty-six. Nine. Jehoshaphat was eighteen years old when he became king. Can you read it here? He's eight years old. That's right. eighteen. So it says eight yeah. and eighteen. Which one is it? Well, if it's right in the Kings, then it's eighteen. So this Bible's wrong. I don't know what Bible have you got. King James. 
I'd say this is right. Wait, hold on, hold on. So I'm, I'm confused now. So you're saying that the King James Version, the standard that's printed all over the world, mm. yeah. I didn't print this, is wrong. Whoa. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa. The, um, <laughs> no problem. Well, two kings twenty-four. One, two, oh, one kings twenty-four. Yeah. Oh no, a couple of kings. Two kings. Twenty-four. Was it definitely eighteen? Eight. Okay, so if it's yeah. definitely eighteen, then that means the Bible here, well, the King James, is happened, wrong. But, um, yeah. And that's the standard around the world, King James Bible. So the Bible that's sent all over the world, King James, is wrong, according to you. Yeah, but okay. the mistakes do yeah. happen. Mistakes happen, mistakes well, happen not in the Word of God. The Word of God has no mistakes. This yeah. Quran, 100% accurate. Yeah, but I can tell you now, my experiences with the Father, Jesus, and the Holy Spirit. See, so you, see, you, see, you, see, you just said there's mistakes in the Bible. No, 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 I didn't say this, but there's okay. reasons why. Okay. But let, that let, let, let's read, let's read. Let, let's read from yours. Second Chronicles. 22 2. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Please read it. Yeah. Uh, where are we? Two. As I was 22 years old when you became queen. 22 years old? Yeah, and now if we go to the other one. No, 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 wait, wait, wait. Can, can you read that again? <laughs> Yeah. Second Chronicles. Okay. Yeah. Twenty-two. 22 yeah. Can you read it in mind? Yeah. Sorry, was forty-two years. It's not forty-two. So this one. is again another mistake. Not just it's one. Not just twenty-two. It's and, just one. and also when you read it in the other one, there's another one with it. Cause no, no, but, but I just want to understand because you said yeah. just one. I just showed you again yeah. that in this Bible, yeah. NIV, yeah. and the standard King James has yeah. two different numbers. How do you know which one's correct? As far as I'm concerned, this is because how the Holy you, how, how did you, how did the you Spirit The Holy Spirit does print errors or check the Holy Spirit manuscripts? Teaches me. It teaches me. I don't ask know ask the Holy Spirit yeah. if you can turn to Matthew <laughs> yeah. 1.16, please. <laughs> I know he's got Jacob, the father of Joseph. Okay. You're going to say that Jacob wasn't the father of Joseph. I didn't say that. The, the Bible says that. Right. I am not going to say done that. I've it with someone else. I don't know who you did it with, yeah. but it wasn't me. Yeah, it wasn't you. Yeah, <laughs> and let me just make it clear, that's not what I'm going to say. If you open up Luke 3.23. Yeah, Luke 3.23. I want to hear the Holy Spirit sound. Now Jesus himself was 30 years old when he was in the strength of the He was a son of so just thought of Joseph. The son of Heli, the son of Mother. Okay, so I'm sorry. Who was the Joseph son of here? Yeah, now I can tell you now. That's Heli, right? Okay, so so I didn't say he's yeah, no, not no, the no, son. No, no, no. Just to be clear. But like in the, like it's in the Jewish thing, mm -hmm. in the Jewish, um, Jewish thing. Uh, Jewish time. Jewish time? Jewish, Jewish, time? Jewish um, Better be careful, Ron. Jewish, I'm Jewish. Gonna, I'm get anti on you here. <laughs> no, 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 I think Jews I mean, live in all different times. No, 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 no,